of rain, a lot of wind last night. Just need to assess the damage. Hopefully there isn't any. So let's go and have a look. Everything looks all right. I, re I really need to get this tree done. Do I don't know? Do something with this pear tree. Is it? No wonder. Let's have a look. Come on. Yeah, that. I need to get that staked in properly. Let's have a look. really print a new one of those and secure it properly um, so much rain we've had that was empty yesterday Jeez. greenhouse secure well the greenhouse greenhouse hasn't fell apart normally when we have a bit of bit of rain uh, sorry a bit of wind so we push it back in the doors fall off. Pretty happy with that. I'll tell you what I need to do though. This is getting a bit of a mud fest. Let's get some bark chickens in there. So I'll put a couple of barrel loads of bark chickens in the coop. I don't want to put too much in in one go because these guys give that an hour I can't actually see it we'll give that an hour keep falling over in the mud that'll be flat I mean literally I've just put the last load in with 30 seconds ago and they're already spreading it but it's full of worms and bugs we we'll get the bark chippings from a tree surgeon uh, these have been at the bottom of my plot for a while now, so they've started to rot down, but there's loads of worms and bugs. Just give these guys something to do, something to dig around, do a bit of foraging. Plus it's free food. One thing I've noticed is they're not drinking their water and as I've come down well, earlier I noticed they're drinking out of this now this needs replacing now ideally in the wood sound it's just this top bit it's gone a bit soft so I'm just gonna get my screwdriver just trying to drain some of the water out of here and stop them from drinking that water really it's a bit here as well that see I've had these years this one's not too bad but I want to get them replaced if I'm honest I think autumn's finally here. I noticed it's getting cold in the mornings. And trees changing colour. A couple weeks ago we had a fox attack. Took a load of chickens up the top. And one thing that surprised me is that some people didn't know this, but in my hand, it's a bottle of my wee. Um, apparently, foxes don't like the smell of male urine. 
It's what I've been doing. I've been doing this years actually. I, yeah, it was one of the first things I found when I'm keeping chickens. But all I've been doing is when I come down, have a wee in the bottle and spray it around my pot. Seems to work. So all I'm literally doing, it's like fly around in my, in my nose, is literally just spray it. Like I said, it seems to work. I've not had any foxes on my plot. There's people down here all the time. And they see, they, they see foxes on everyone's plot. Apart from mine. I just spray it about and it seems to work. So I'm just going to go around here. on this compost bin here but yeah little tip if you keep chickens and you've got problems with foxes male urine can you get out my shot come on. so it's the day after after I spread all that um, bark chippings about and they've spread it nicely. I see a lot of people on this site spreading it themselves. I honestly don't see the point. I chuck it in. Let your chickens do the work. You know what, obviously I'll keep topping this up over the, over the next couple of weeks. Yeah, if you put putting bark chippings in, put it in a pile, chickens do the work, gives them something to do as well.